Yo, what up everybody, Uncle Jesse with your welcome, it's Monday, got some Monday Night Football, but before we get to the football, gotta show the baseball some love, 2016 Bowman's Best Baseball, 8 box, full case break number 1, yeah you guessed the eBay style, come on, oh wait a minute, Where, there it is, alright, there we go, Got the case here. Now don't don't pay any attention to that noise. There's just you know a whole bunch of birds we got around here. I think they release them or something from like the parrot jungle that we have nearby. What it do, Meg and me? Did did you did you miss me? Haven't seen y'all since Friday. Friday was kind of crazy. I was here till five in the morning breaking. That was that was fun. I was literally breaking the entire day. All right, so we're doing eight boxes of this. Should be some good stuff in here. Bowman's best is a uh, very very nice stuff. A good mix of prospect and veteran autos. Let's see what we're going to get. It's going to be a Astros Dodgers World Series. First game is tomorrow, I believe. And as a matter of fact, good luck, everybody. <laughs> always, always courteous. Uh, I can already see an issue. Let me get that fixed. Boom, there it is. How about them dolphins, baby? How about them dolphins? You know, I can't wait to see Chris Fitz in here. Because he's a big Jets fan. And, well, you guys all know I'm a huge Dolphin fan. But this weekend was just good for, you know, all around Miami sports teams. The Heat killing it. The Canes killing it. It's a shame we didn't move up in the uh, in the ranking. You would think we would, considering you know we beat the team that beat the uh, defending national champs. Dude, I can't say I'm happy Cutler went down because you know unless it's Tom Brady, uh, I, I really don't like when people get hurt. Um, with that being said, and more we trust. How about the Rams? Yo, Rams also killing it, dude. Todd Gurley. Shaking off, uh, you know, the crappy year he had last year. Golf got some weapons out there. You know, I was wondering why they were so high up in the power ranking. I think NFL.com had him like number three or something like that. And now I know why. That young head coach they got out there, man, they, they got those boys playing at a very high level. How did y'all's teams do this weekend? Man, any Astro fans in here? Astros made it to the show, baby! Alright, let's uh, start this show here. Came to my Ada. These cards are very pretty. You think Moore is a better quarterback? You know what? Oh, well, before I continue, check out this sweet Anderson Espinosa auto. That's nice, on card. I don't know if he's a better quarterback, but I know for a fact that um, the fans like him a lot more. One, you know, pun intended, and uh, also he, he just he just takes more shots downfield, man. In, in my opinion, and that's 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 what I want from my quarterback. Someone who's not afraid to take a shot downfield. I understand, you know, they're trying to get Cuddy back in the in the thick of things, but they should have never signed them in the first place. Got a Judge base card. Judge had a pretty decent... Uh, now we can reflect back on the Yankee season. What do, we, what do we think about Aaron Judge and what he's going to do in the future? I think he's going to be a superstar, man. He did really good for a rookie. Just, uh, you know, got to make some adjustments now. Now, I just want to let you guys know, these mirror image cards, we're going to have to random. Uh, mainly because there's two different teams on there. So I'll set these aside. And uh, we're just going to random them all at once at the end of the break. Tyler O'Neill, 
with the autograph for the Mariners. Yeah, Adrian Peterson got shut down too. But what sucks is <clears throat> he probably wouldn't have got shut down if their quarterback didn't get hurt. I heard uh, the quarterback out there in Arizona got hurt. <laughs> My boy Carson. That's uh, that's not good. Got Luis Severino here, the Yankees, numbered 96 of 250. Alright, let's see what's in this one. Palmer out six to eight weeks. Yeah, he, he might just be done for the year. Cause uh gotta also take into consideration how old the man is. Carson Palmer's gotta be at in you know at least in the plus thirties. Yeah, man. Penn State absolutely, you know, motorboated Michigan. It was pretty bad. It was pretty bad. I'm just, you know, I, I kind of feel some kind of way that Miami didn't go up in the rankings. We stayed at number eight. But uh, we got some tough, some tough, tough uh, games coming up. We played North Carolina this weekend up in Chapel Hill. That's going to be a tough, that's a trap game right there. Uh, we also play Virginia Tech later on. That's a tough game. We also play Notre Dame. So if we can run the table... Who knows, man? We, we we just might crack the top four. You pull the 10 out of 10 Steve Young patch? That is, that is sexy. That is sexy, Megan. Me. Did you play the lottery afterward? I, I probably would have. See these mirror image cards? They have to be random. Because it's two different teams on the left and right side. So, that's how that goes down. Henry Owens with the best of 2016 auto redemption. I do believe that this is for the Red Sox. I could be mistaken though. I hope I hope Penn State wins against Ohio State by like a landslide. I need I need at least a 30 40 point victory. And the Hurricanes got to do the same cuz I just honestly I just want to get into that top 4. I just want a shot at the playoff. Pretty nice cracked ice there for Will Myers Padres. Nicholas, I will definitely try. What else we got? 25 out of 50. Cal Quantrill for the Padres. That's a cool, nice-looking gold right there. I really do like Bowman's Best. Very, very nice product. Ooh, check this out. That's pretty sweet. For the Dodgers, 48 out of 50. Kenta Maeda with the auto. I'm doing well, uh, Nicholas. I'm doing well. How about you, man? Did you enjoy your weekend? You know, I know you had your, your Cardboard Jesus fix. My boy uh, going live now on the weekends. See, here's another mirror image. Again, different teams. So the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to random them uh, either to the left or right side team. And we'll do that random at the end of the break. So my weekend was pretty cool. I got to see the Hurricanes uh, for the actually for the first time ever. I'd never seen a Hurricane game on Saturday. That was pretty cool. Little nail biter, you know. They they something about Miami sports teams. We just gotta make it close. I don't know what it is, but we just have to make it close. Dolphins came up with a victory yesterday. I don't know how, but I'll take it. Matt Moore looking like Tom Brady. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Matt Moore looking like not Jay Cutler out there. Good times. Good. I cannot. Yo, Chris Fitz. I'm. Uh, I was just talking about you, man. How, how how are you doing? How are you doing? I did not have a sign, and it's not like it would have mattered, because the camera did not sh show your boy like not even once. Yeah, I don't know if that's the greatest thing to ever happen to me. I think the greatest thing that ever happened to me was my senior year of high school when I lost my virginity. That was probably the coolest thing ever. But I will say Jay Cutler getting hurt is a close second to the greatest thing that ever happened to me. You were looking for me? Trust me, you weren't going to find me. I was up there, uh, you know, sky high. Like, you know, I felt like I was in the Himalayas. With that being said... Great game. The stadium is gorgeous. 
It was, a, it was a fun time. You already know the deal. Got to random these at the end. Yeah, Jets Jets were on their way to to take. But you know what? Jay Cutler wasn't doing too bad up until he got hurt. You know, he he was doing a lot better offensively than he was before. I'll say that much. Uh, am I upset that he's hurt? I'm not upset. I do wish him a speedy recovery. And but you know, I, I just hope he doesn't play for us anymore. And that means Diaz number six of fifty on card auto for the Cardinals. That's a sweet looking card. Look at that, that orange right there. That's a sexy card. Now we do play this Thursday, so it's gonna be a quick turnaround. Which is kind of good for Matt Moore, you know, because Matt Moore is extremely streaky. Brendan Rodgers cracked ice for the Rockies. That's a sweet card. Cutler only out two weeks. Well, I hope he played his last game in a... I'll tell you what. If Matt Moore keeps doing what he's been doing, Cuddy ain't coming back. Not for the Dolphins. Cal Quantrill with the auto. I believe that's the second autograph there for the Padres. <laughs> that you know what Chris Fitz if I was to see that you guys can tell my voice is still a little gone from Saturday dude if I was to see that meme I'd probably cry Chris Fitz on a like all bullshit aside on a scale of 1 to 10 how pissed off were you that we came back and won dude I mean, Josh McCown did a lot of good things, but has the guy ever heard of, you know, throwing the ball away? <laughs> you don't care? <laughs> I hear you, Chris Fitz. And coming, as a, coming from a fan that has become accustomed to mediocrity, I completely understand what you're, where you're coming from. I'm just glad we beat y'all boys, you know. God forbid the Jets beat us twice, you know, in a season. Then I got to hear from you. I got to hear from Gelf. I got to hear from all my other Jets fan friends, which I don't know why they're my friends still, but they're there. So, you know, all in all, 50-50, I'll take it. No Syndergaard, speaking of New York, the Mets right there, numbered 121 out of 150. You know, now, now that the Jets are out the way, now it's time to focus on the Bills and the Yankees. Um, and the Yankees. And the, uh, well, yeah, the Yankees, too. If you're the Marlins. A.J. Puck, auto for the A's. I meant the the Patriots, but they might as well be the Yankees, too, the way they're winning. Shit. TCU, the Jets suck, suck, suck. We got that W. Yo, TCU Horn Frog as a uh well first off, Troy Tulowitzki, Corey Seager with the cracked ice mirror image insert. That's pretty cool. As a college football fan, what do you think about Miami, bro? Do you think we're do you think we're good at the eight spot? Should we be higher? Should we be lower? Talk to me. Another mirror image. Gotta random these at the end, folks. For the Blue Jays, Anthony Alford with the auto. Well, I didn't say Finns to the Yankees. I said Yankees to the Patriots. I said Yankees to Patriots. As far as, like, you know, the dynasty, man. Dude, I was going to say, the Kansas, the Kansas University football program is probably the worst in the nation. And it sucks because they have one of the best basketball programs in the nation. Uh, no Tigers that I can think of so far. However, we do have a ways to go. So there is, you know, hope to be had. Well, Mega Meat, we do have one box left of the Leaf Sports uh, Heroes and the Ultimate uh, Draft Football. So if you guys want to get that thing breaking tonight in between the eBay breaks or even after the eBay breaks are done, go ahead and buy your spot. 
Yeah, Kansas has been only basketball for a, for as long as I can remember. How many more cases? What do you mean? Well, we have one, two, three, four, five boxes. And, you know, the one I'm doing now, so that's a total of six. So I've only done two boxes. Yep, got one box left for the lead draft. Uh, I'm not sure what happened to all of it. I think CBJ went, you know, went balls deep on that. I, I know, Nicholas, I know. I just, you know. I'm weird. Anyways, TCU, what are your thoughts on, on the Hurricanes, though? I felt like we should at least moved up a spot in the ranking. At least seven or six. Sean Newcomb with the cracked ice for the Braves. Then again, you know, I've, I've, obviously I'm a Hurricane fan, so I want them boys at the number one spot. Andy Pettit, number 31 out of 35 for the Yankees. That's a cool looking card. Got that old school design on there. That's sweet. What do we got here? We got Ian Anderson for the Braves on card auto. Very nice. You think Miami's overrated? Ouch. Well, hey, I did ask for your opinion, so that's what I get. And I agree, we haven't really played anyone yet. With that being said, I feel like the teams we have played are underrated. Jacoby Ellsbury, Mickey Moniak, mirror image. That's got to get random. What is this? Ooh, this is sweet. Kyle Schwarber, 69 out of 99. On card auto right there. That is nice. The Florida State game, you know, it, of course it counts because, come on, man, we beat them, which is huge for our program because now kids watching that game are thinking, oh, snap, the U is back. I don't think I want to play for Florida State anymore. Let me go play in Coral Gables now. So that's huge for, like, our future recruiting classes. Yeah, that Kyle Schorber is pretty big time. That's a very nice card. Very, very nice card. <clears throat> you know, I always think Alabama's overrated until I see them play like, you know, a fellow top three, you know, top three, four team or whatever. And then they just, you know, run rough shot all through them. Then again, I never liked Alabama ever since uh, Coach Saban, you know, Gave up on the Dolphins and went over there. Well, Josh Barnes, Origins Football is going to go on. I think that went already, actually, this past weekend. I'll check the schedule here, and I'll let you know in a few what's going on there. We really need to start blowing teams out, you know, the, the the Hurricanes. You already know the deal with the mirror image. Check this sweet Ozzy Albies for the Braves. You think he autographed that big enough? I could barely see that thing. I'm going to top load this thing. Who's winning the series, though? Dodgers or Astros? I will be rooting for the Astros. Nothing personal against the Dodgers. Uh, I just want to see a team that's never won a World Series win a World Series. A cracked ice for Ichiro of the Marlins. Dodgers and six. Ooh. That's a fairly uh, detailed prophecy. Riley Pint for the Rockies with the on card auto. It's a kind of cool looking auto there. I just want to see the Astros win their first World Series. That'd be cool. And honestly, I feel like the city of Houston needs it. Although, Los Angeles could use some love too. I know they're dealing with the, 
their fair share of, uh, you know, disasters out there with all those crazy fires that are going on. Mirror image, we got a random at the end. Nolan Arenado, but that's not numbered. It's also expensive to live out there, rah rah. There's also expensive. So that Schwarber we've hit so far is pretty big time. Wondering what the rest of this case is gonna look like. I'm on box number four right now. Uh, so at the halfway point technically should be good should be good and then later on at 9 we're going to do certified cut football at 11 optic baseball and then at midnight chrome baseball so we got a, we got a few eBay breaks to do here Am I going to do number block breaks for NT Baseball? Yes, I am, Kestis. If you look on our website, it's already posted, baby! By the way, I apologize for my voice. You know, I got a little crazy on Saturday at the Hurricane game. I couldn't help myself. To 250, Michael Fulmer of the Tigers. The autograph goes to the Rays, Blake Snell. What up, Kyle Smith? How you doing? Yeah, there's a, lot, there's a lot of baseball going on. I would like to get some basketball, but uh, those products do release on Wednesday. NBA Hoops comes out on Wednesday, which I believe is the first rookies in their NBA uniforms, in their pro unis. So that might be sexy because, uh, you know, your boy is big on the basketball. And I got to say, the 2017 NBA draft class might just be the next best thing. So that is for Kyle Lewis of the Mariners. Got a spot in the leaf draft. Very nice. I don't know how many spots we're at now. I think we're probably at three left on the leaf ultimate draft football. Guaranteed auto. Let's fill that up so that uh we can get that thing crack a lacking after I'm done with this break, guys. Yeah, it's a, it's a full caser, Kestis. It's a full caser. So, you know, the odds of you hitting something good are up there. Uh, Maggot Meat, I would have to look. I believe it's, if you go to our website, it's it says so in the description. Frank Mason out of Kansas. Yeah, man, the Jayhawks, they're, they're a basketball factory. I like Dennis Smith Jr., out there uh, playing for Dallas. He, he was probably the sleeper. I feel you, Kestis. I'm not mad at that. Um, I will say, though, I think we also have a one-box break of that. Uh, one-box number block style. So if you want to take, uh, take a go at that one, probably have good odds, too. I mean, not as good as the four-caser, obviously. <clears throat> just because the numbers, you know. But, uh, hey, you got to risk it for the biscuit, you know what I'm saying? Mike Clevenger for Cleveland with the auto. Yeah, Dallas is not good, but uh, I think they got something in Dennis Smith, man. I think they got something in Dennis Smith. A Yoan Moncada cracked ice for the Red Sox. That's pretty cool. Yeah, we also have the one box Kesta. So if you want to take a shot at it, you know that's uh, a little a, a little bit smaller of an L dog. But if you want to go for glory, uh, then the four box break, you know, is is where it's at. Honestly, it's the full caser. Noah Syndergaard of the Mets. 
You know, and, and NT is, uh, as we all know, is that fancy. Tyler O'Neal with the on-card auto for the Mariners. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, with NT, it's worth it to go big or go home. You know what I mean? Because uh, you get a couple hits, and you pretty much got the return on your investment. And in a full caser, you have good odds of that. Who doesn't need a judge? I will say this much. Make sure you do look at the checklist uh, for whichever team it is you're looking for. As always, you know, you should always do your research. What's up, MN Sports Cards? How you doing? Uh, which one is that, Josh Barnes? I don't have the website pulled up, so I'm not sure what you mean. Got a spot in the Leaf Draft. Very nice. The Leaf Draft is at three right now. Leafs Middle Sports Heroes at four. Um, let me see. Random divisions of what exactly? Oh, you mean Prism Football? Yeah, that's. I'm looking at that now. It's a half case or random division style. So, you do get four teams for your division, which uh, I think is really good odds at getting some greatness. A uh, Miggy coming your way, Nicholas. Miguel Cabrera incoming. I'm doing well, MN Sports Cards. I'm doing well. Uh, I, I did indeed need that time off the weekend. You know, get some sleep. Actually hang out with some friends and family. So, that was cool. Recharge the batteries, if you will. Because you know your boy's in here, you know, in the office pretty much... I would say all day, but that's a lie because I sleep during the day. But pretty much all night, you know. I'm in here till 6 in the morning. It's still selling by the team. I'm going to have to look into that, Josh. So uh, give me give me a sec. Aaron Judge with a base. Cod. Let me see what's going on with that. I mean, that'll be a quick fix. Yeah, I see what you mean. Uh, I'll fix that when I have the opportunity. Uh, after I'm done with this break, I'll, I'll get on that and I'll fix that, uh, Josh. Yeah, dog, I, I noticed it. Thank you, I appreciate that. Uh, a little late to the party. But uh, what I'm going to do, actually, let me go ahead and just... I disabled it. So you can't buy anything even if, if, even if you wanted to. Another one for the Indians, Mike Clevenger. That's a good one right there. All right, took it out the store. I'll get that fixed as soon as I'm done with this break, right, guys? That stuff comes out on Wednesday. So I do appreciate you guys trying to get the pre-sale going. That's awesome. That way, when it comes into the to the office, everything's full, and then we just get the breaking, baby. Kind of like Friday, man. Friday was pretty awesome. Friday was pretty awesome. For the Marlins, Braxton Garrett. That's a good one right there. This uh, this case has been pretty solid. Some, some good names in this so far. We still have another mini to go and three other boxes. So let's see what else can be had. Francisco Lindor of the Indians to 99. So much for the Indians. I was kind of rooting for them, you know, especially after the way they went out last year. I was going to think, oh, yeah, Indians going to go back to the World Series. Yankees had something to say about that. I think the Yankees might be scary in the future, man. Next year, Yankees just might be scary. That's the goal for broke. Yeah, right, rah rah. Yeah, that's that's what's that's what's crazy about baseball is you know you could you could be a hundred plus win team in the season, but when it comes to the playoffs, all bets are off, which is kind of cool.
Let me see if I can get this thing fixed. I'm gonna multitask a little here while I open packs. Well, I'm trying to do that prism football in the store. All right, it should be working now. It should be, you know, what it was supposed to be, random divisions, as opposed to having teams available. Yep, it is fixed. I did that real quick. All right. Here we go. Correa balling. The whole Astro team's just balling. Even their rookie, Alex Bregman, doing big things. Coming through in the clutch. And Jameson Tyone for the Pirates with the auto. That's kind of a cool auto, too. It's a little cool auto there. Uh, when is it supposed to stop selling? I'm not sure. Uh, I do believe maybe an hour. I mean, half an hour before the... Uh, the break is actually supposed to go. Like, I'll tell you right now, 25 minutes left on the non-NFL spot. Uh, going all the way up to the last spot you can get is the Cardinals, 57 minutes a lap. So, 8.31, the last team will go. A Kyle Lewis cracked ice for the Mariners. That's pretty sweet. It is pretty crazy, especially when you consider the craziness that... You know what? I, I never did post that picture of Lionel Messi. I'll probably do that now. Yoan Moncada, number to 250 for the Red Sox. Red Sox probably should have held on to that guy. Because uh, he did go to the White Sox. Speaking of the White Sox, Carlos Rodon with the auto. On-card auto, always sexy. Let the people know, James Kyan. Let them know what's in that Leaf Metal. Absolutely crazy stuff in there. I did pull a uh, one of one Lionel Messi uh, on Friday. That is a ridiculous card. And I think the best card I've ever pulled, honestly. Well, Megan Mean, I don't know if you heard, bro, but I already pulled the 101 Lionel Messi. Now your boy got to pull that Ronaldo. And I want to pull that Mayweather uh, Conor McGregor dual auto that's lurking in there. That card will go for some stupid money. Yeah, man. Very nice stuff in there. I mean, freaking Ric Flair, dude. Ric Flair has autographs in that. Like, crazy. I see some spots got up, uh, got picked up for the Leaf Ultimate. I think that's down to two spots left. Three spots left in the Leaf Ultimate. All right, what else we got here? For the White Sox, Tim Anderson. Man, Bowman's Best is really a very nice product. I do dig the design. I mean, I mean, I, I'm usually more into the simple designs but i do like this a little futuristic a little crazy but not too crazy and the on-card autos always 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 a good thing for the mets to 99 justin dunn that's another cool looking guard what do you mean josh what you talking about josh Mirror image, we'll random those at the end. 
that's a good card right there, folks. Andrew Benintendi for the Red Sox autograph. That's a good card. This has been a pretty solid case. Very solid case. Oh, the Leaf Draft. Yeah, I don't think there'll be... Well, I don't think we have any more. I'm going to go check my other cage and see maybe CBJ move some stuff over there. Number to 50, Steven Strasburg of the Nationals. That's pretty sweet. As of now, I have one box left of the Leaf Meadow and the Leaf Ultimate. Just looking at my cage right now. Did CBJ go through all that stuff already? You know, what's cool about those Leaf products also is you're guaranteed to autograph. And I mean, last I checked, that's a pretty sweet deal. He went through one. Well, I do remember when I left Friday, there were like, I think there were like six boxes of each left. And I only have one in my cage, so it's a little curious. It's a little curious. You know, I would hit up CBJ and ask him, but uh, he's in class right now. With the lady friend. In case you guys didn't know, the man is having a baby. Alex Kirilov for the twins with the auto. And a lot of those breaks that are in the store, you know, don't come out until Wednesday. You know, we still got some good stuff in the store. That high tech baseball. That stuff needs to get gone because there's some nice stuff in there. JP Crawford with the cracked ice for the Phillies. Andrew Benintendi to 250 for the Red Sox. You know, I know a lot of you guys watching are into baseball. Uh, what what tells what you know what gives me that indication is the fact that I'm doing a baseball break. So for those of you that would like to join more baseball breaks like the stuff we have in the store. Go to RipCityCards.com, register for an account, and you can save $15 on your first purchase. Probably get you into this Royals right here, Garrett Davila with the auto. Mirror image, that's got to get random. I hear you, Josh, I hear you. You know, I know, but I, you know... I do know that some of you, wow, that was kind of weird. I do know some of you guys are, are into money, though. I know that for sure. And I will say this much, man. Baseball is where the money is at. Got two boxes left of this Bowman's Best. So far, it's been pretty solid. If you haven't hit yet, however, I do wish you good luck. Still got uh, four mini boxes to go through. I'm doing one of them right now. So you still got a chance at a hit. Come on, baby. Ah, gotcha, Josh, gotcha. Well, baseball stuff is very nice to collect. I mean, that National Treasures baseball is going to be ridiculous. Ma Mickey Mantle is going to have autographs in that for the first time ever of the National Treasures products uh, run. So that's pretty big time. Numbered. 244 to 250 Buster Posey of the Giants. Got an autograph here. Pretty sweet. First impressions, the 14th overall pick. Will Benson of the Indians. That's a sweet card. Well, Kestas, that should be the that should be the case. 
that should be the case. You know, you, sh you shouldn't buy into a break unless you absolutely love the product. Or, at the very least, absolutely love the potential of, you know, flipping that thing. And, you know, having your money make you some more. Because at the end of the day, who doesn't like that? Will Craig of the Pirates with the autograph. You know that we we do have a saying in the in the hobby. All it takes is one. All it takes is one. What it do, D Rich? Why you gotta give me the finger, bro? That's not even cool. I thought we was homies, dog. How's everything with you, man? I know what it is, D Rich. You know, you know me, dog. You gotta break your balls every now and then. How's everything with you, D Rich? Long time no see, dog. You forgot about your boy. See how it is. See how it is. We got a random Gavin Lux of the Dodgers with an auto. A little bit, man. A little bit. A little bit. D Rich, you know, things are starting to pick up a little bit. Not quite where I would like to be, though. You know, I'm still trying to get to that level where I'm constantly breaking. But we, we getting there, my man. We getting there. Corey Ray of the Brewers with the cracked ice. For the Diamondbacks, Anthony Banda with the on-card auto. Not sure if you know this, D-Rich, but your boy's been streaming into the wee hours of the night. Trying to get some West Coast folks up in here. You know, so don't be surprised if you wake up, you know, 4 or 5 in the morning to, you know, get ready for work. And your boy's still in here putting in work. You know, don't be surprised. Alright, last box mojo. Good luck to everybody. Oh, dude, Josh, that was the greatest show on turf back then. Although, I'll never forgive that team. Because, you know, I blame them for the start of the Patriots dynasty. I lied. I really blame the, the Raiders. But, uh, Rams, I also blame. I've hit autographs for all of them except uh, Kurt Warner. I'm going to with these packs. I mean, yeah, sounds good, D-Rich. I mean, a lot of the stuff on the website right now is uh, stuff that's pre-sale, stuff that comes out on Wednesday. Uh, but the high tech baseball, I got that. Leaf Ultimate Draft, I got that. The Leaf uh, Leaf Metal Sports Heroes, I got that. The Collegiate NT, your boy got that. So we can work on that stuff. Joshua Lowe or the Rays to 99. Pirates having a decent break. Elias Diaz with the auto. I think that's the third Pirates auto. I see a redemption in there. That certified cuts is not until 9 o'clock. Uh, so we do have time to work on some store breaks, peeps. These mirror images, gonna have to random those. I see the redemption. I'm gonna slow roll it. See what it is. It's a best of 2016 auto refracted parallel of Tuki Toussaint. Who I believe is a Diamondback, but I could be mistaken. There's a 90% chance I'm mistaken. 
that's why we have things like group break checklist baby number one resource uh, we use to figure out where these players go as far as their teams in case anyone out there is wondering well how does he know all right last mini last chances at some autos Let's see what we got Yeah, OJ Howard had a pretty good game like uh, the other the other day, and by that I mean yesterday. That was well. I did pull the Jolly Roger patch auto. I like how that's actually a name now. The Buccaneers should thank me for that. That really should be on, like on the eBay listing. Jolly Roger patch auto of you know whatever whatever. You know, let's start. Let's start a trend. CBM did it first for the Yankees. Jorge Mateo with the autograph. And what product was that, Jolly Roger? I think it was in maybe Certified Cuts or or maybe it was the Phoenix. I I don't recall. Glay Bear with the cracked ice for the Yankees. That's pretty sweet. For the Yankees, the 35, Jorge Mateo. Very nice. Very nice. And what else we got? I believe there's one more auto in here. And it's going to be for the Brewers, Josh Hader. Don't be a hater. Uh, ran out of sleeves. I'll throw it in this one. I think it should fit. Oh, that top loader's just <clears throat> throw it in here. And if it's perfect. Very nice. What else we got? And that, well, besides from that, there's another mirror base there. And this Aaron Judge insert for the Yankees. That is the break. Now, as I said, I do have to random all these mirrored image cards if you notice on the back of the card there are two different teams there are the Giants and the White Sox on this one you know obviously depends like that one will go to the Nationals obviously if they have the same team it goes to that team but uh, as you'll notice a lot of those mirror image have you know two different teams so they need to be randomed where are my dice here they are I'm going to roll dice, see what team is going to go to. Or how many times we're going to random it, I should say. So we're going to go three times. Let me pull up the random list. Boom. I mean, we do, we do nice things like that around here, MN Sports Cards. That must have been the uh, the CBJ if it was uh, on Saturday. Because your boy was watching the Canes, baby. Getting my tailgate on. That was such a good time. Alright. We're going three times. And it's going to be between the left team. And the right team. Three times in the random for the mirror image inserts good luck we got one we got two and the money shot three so it's going to the left hand side team write that down boom put it on my post-it notes and now recap time not a bad break. Not a bad break at all. Here we go. Hater, Brewers, Mateo, Yankees, a Toussaint Redemption, Diaz, Pirates, Banda, Diamondbacks, Lux, Dodgers, Craig, Pirates, Benson, Indians, 
Davila Royals, Kirilov Twins, Benintendi Red Sox. That's huge. Dunn Mets, Anderson White Sox, Rodon White Sox, Tyone Pirates, Garrett Marlins. That's a big card. Clevenger Indians, another good one. O'Neill Mariners, Clevenger again for the Indians. Kyle Lewis Mariners, that's a good card. Blake Snell Rays, that's nice. Riley Pint Rockies, Ozzy Albies. Kyle Schwarber with the rookie card to 99, that's a big time card. Anderson Braves, Alfred Blue Jays, Puck Athletics, Quantrill Padres. Diaz Cardinals to 50. Maeda Dodgers to 50. That's sweet. Henry Owens Redemption for the Red Sox. O'Neill Mariners. And Espinosa Padres. And that, my friends, was 2016 Bowman's Best Baseball 8 Box Full Case Break Number 1 eBay Style. Thank you very much, guys. We'll get it out to you.